is one of our capstone programs taken by seniors and it's a year-long project where students work with and for an external sponsor on a project that is important to the sponsor. I think of SCOPE as a true capstone. Because the students have been working on these important skills, professional skills and design skills, they've been working on teams, they've been working on communication skills, they've been tackling open-ended problems, they've seen the design process from start to finish. So by the time they get to Capstone, we're able to give them a chance to synthesize that and put it all together at a more advanced level. Before the beginning of the year, we sign on 13 to 14 sponsors from all different industries and define projects that we think are going to be a great fit for our students. The projects range in terms of discipline, in terms of where they are on a spectrum of, of the development cycle. Last week the students learned about the teams that they were on, researching their sponsor, but today is really the day they get to meet in person their liaison for the first time. I'm Sunan Bhattacharya from Autodesk and I've worked with Olin for a few years. This is our senior capstone project where we're working with Tata Motors and Autodesk as well as five students from Coventry University in the UK to design a concept for an autonomous vehicle for aging adults. Autonomous vehicles are in the future. Everybody has sort of a horse in this race, but nobody's really looking at how they can help the people who stand to benefit from it the most. The preliminary phases have really just been getting our feet wet, getting a sense of who our user group is and what their needs actually are. One thing that's really exciting about this program is that the students get to work on a range of projects. So not only a range of disciplines, but a range of places along the timeline of a project development. I'm on the Raytheon Scope team. And what we are trying to do for this project is to overall make circuits less resource intensive. We've been working on a very, very technical project, working on science of magnetics and also modeling of circuit elements. We were told that at the beginning that this project was going to be drinking from a fire hose as far as like learning and, and work at the beginning goes with like gaining knowledge, which it definitely was. And it seemed like completely unsurmountable at first. And I think we have a really good grasp of it now. I see this project as a great opportunity. It really helps bring education down to a real world level and what we can expect after we graduate. The students are working throughout the year doing design reviews, writing written deliverables, and at the same time they're working really directly with the sponsor liaison, talking to them at least weekly. We've only got a month left and we still have the book and the prototype to create. Um, so what do we want those things to be? We are in the final month and a half in our scope project. We want to design our final test vehicle, which is an impedance transformer that none of us have encountered before. Summit Day is really the day that we get to celebrate all of the hard work that the students have done for the entire year. At this point, they've turned in their reports, they've given technical presentations to their sponsors, they're almost ready to graduate, and this is the day that they come, they give a very public presentation and, and show off what they've done. So today I like really assessed how much work had been done and where we'd gone and I think I'm really proud of how the project came out. And so on the technical side, Olin teaches you how to learn. They teach you how to, how to teach yourself. We had to start from scratch with our knowledge of all of the technology that we were working with. Um, and I think that really came together. We really look for what the teams have accomplished and whether they're providing value to the sponsors. And we see across the board that the sponsors are thrilled with the work the students are doing. What our company gets from this interaction with Olin is uh, the research and new young bright minds that we could potentially have as Raytheon employees in the future. Every year we've continued to be um, surprised and impressed by the caliber of the students' skills and the experience that they can bring to the table. We were all so invested in the project. We have generated a model that we're really excited about. I gained more from that than I had initially thought I ever would. <laughs>